F1 in Schools is a multidisciplinary STEM project aimed at students between the age of 9 and 19 years old. Students use CAD CAM software to design, analyse, make, test, race, miniature F1 style cars and project manage their projects where they'll compete regionally and nationally and if they make it through that competition all the way out of world finals. The main objective of F1 in Schools is to engage students with STEM education. The benefits of, of undertaking F1 in Schools for students is just monumental. Genuinely, I'm going to struggle to put it into words. It's an opportunity for them to really find a passion, to really refine and hone their skills in engineering, project management, marketing, social media, even presenting and their resilience. In terms of how that then develops into career opportunities, it opens their eyes to skills that they didn't even know they had now an integral part of our enrichment curriculum. It's something we do every single week. It's just grown from strength to strength. The students are drawn from right across the year groups and right across the whole curriculum because there's, there's bits of F1 that play to different people's academic strengths, which is what's really good about it. It's that ability to have those who can talk and present, that, which fits in with your spoken language for English. But you've then also got those engineers who are doing all the design side of it and the racing side and the building. When Offset came to the UTC, they were really blown away by our enrichment opportunities and F1 is very much part of that. They can really see the bonus, that benefit of our curriculum structure that enables all learners to be part of an enrichment project. But it was the enthusiasm and the passion that came through from the students about F1 that really impressed Ofsted. The best part about competing F1 in schools is probably just the enjoyment of learning new things every day, the confidence that I gain by speaking to sponsors and also being able to use technology and software that you wouldn't normally get to use at such a young age. Using the Denford CNC router, the Airtrace, Wind Tunnel, Autodesk, CFD and Flow and these technologies that will help me in the future in industry, it's really something that I'm very proud of that I've got to learn. Lenovo is the title sponsor for F1 in schools. Lenovo provides things like the Lenovo ThinkPad laptops, which are fantastic across all age groups. They're really easy to use, really intuitive, especially at the younger age where people might be using things like Fusion 360 from Autodesk. But we also do things such as virtual reality headsets and glasses, which are brilliant for bringing a full immersive learning to the setting. The Nova F1 in Schools UK National Final is officially open! Best of luck! Very, very easy for schools to sign up for F1 in Schools. It's also very, very easy for them to attend regional finals and national finals, even if it's just to see, and just to see what the competition entails and, and what other teams are doing. But the, the support from F1 in Schools to be able to facilitate that is absolutely amazing. The best bit of F1 in Schools is actually competing at the events as you get to network with different teams and see how all your hard work and time that you've put into it pays off by seeing the car go down the track and having judging for design and enterprise and also your verbal presentation. The costs involved with F1 in schools are relatively inexpensive you need to pay a small registration fee for your events for regional and national and world competitions and then you just need to buy consumables, anything from model blocks to starter kits all the way up to racetracks and systems. Sign up for F1 in Schools, it's really easy. Go to www.f1inschools.com and click on the registration tab, put your details in to sign up now.